Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you guys what we got our 13 year old daughter for her stocking stuffers this year. If you missed yesterday's video, I shared what we got her for her tree gifts, like what she's gonna be unwrapping from under the tree. So if you missed that video, I will have it linked in the description box for you guys so you can check that out. Today is though just what we got her for her stocking. We get the girls a different amount of things for their stocking and their tree gifts every year. It really depends on just budget and what they want and what I find for them different things like that. Really not even so much budget, just really what I think they'll like and what they ask for. So this year they do actually have nine stocking stuffers. So the first thing, you may have seen it in the thumbnail, this is actually something that she wanted and asked for. I would not have thought to get her a blanket for her stocking or for Christmas or as a gift at all actually, but she saw this at, at um, Kohl's and she loved it. It's this really soft pink throw with little gold dots and her room now that we redid it over the summer has got some little gold accents on her bedspread and different places so she's really into gold accents right now and she does her a lot of her schoolwork in her room because we homeschool and so she has a desk up there and she said she would like to have this to keep in her room and at her desk so that if she gets cold she can use this so it is really soft and pretty and so actually that is going to go so that is going to go in her stocking this year it's a little big for her stocking but I really base um, what goes in someone's stocking on how much it costs and this blanket actually um, it was ten dollars and so I usually put things in their stocking that are ten dollars or less kind of no matter how big it is um, so that's kind of why it fell into the stocking stuffer category even though it's huge so I'll probably just have to wrap it and kind of put it underneath her stocking but that's okay it's still going to be a stocking stuffer also, I picked up this pen for her. It's just something fun. I, it's fun to write with girly and fun cute pens. I still like writing with fun pens. And so these I found at the Dollar Tree. My youngest daughter actually is going to have one in her stocking as well. But I just thought it would be something really fun for her to write in her planner with or to do even her schoolwork with. And so for a dollar, obviously, it falls into the stocking stuffer category. Also picked up this nail file for her from Sally Beauty. I just thought it was really cute. And she's gotten into really like taking care of her nails and painting them and things like that. So every girl could use a nail file. I also got her some of these Biore pore strips. She has never tried these before. I used to use them when I was younger. Um, and basically you just put them on your nose and let it dry and then it's supposed to help clear your pores. So I thought that'd be something fun that she could do and kind of have a little spa night at home. So I picked those up for her stocking. I also got her a set of the tweezer man. These are the mini tweezers. The glare is terrible, but they're purple. I'll try to take them out so you can see them. I have a tweezer man set in my bathroom and I keep one of these small sets in my car just because you know how it is when you go in the car and you have like an extra eyebrow you didn't know was there like you've got to pluck it. Um, but for her just to start out I got her just the small set and then I can get her a bigger, a bigger set too if she wants one later on. But I thought it was really a good thing to give a young girl who is taking care of themselves or being more, they're more aware of their, you know, making sure their eyebrows are trimmed and their nails are done. So. I thought that was a good thing to start her out with because Tweezer Man I think is the best brand of tweezer that I've ever tried and so I wanted her to have a really good set of tweezers also. I also picked this uh, Burt's Bees lip gloss up for her and this is the Rosy Dawn color. Now I got this before I bought the lip gloss set that she got um, that she's going to get for her one of her tree presents if you saw that yesterday. Um, so this is more of a natural lip gloss. It says 100% natural. so. Um, as opposed to the one yesterday, which is definitely not, but I thought, you know, it's a pretty color and it is more natural, so I feel better about giving her this one. And I also got her this Essence All About Roses eyeshadow palette. I thought this was really pretty. She's really into soft, muted colors, so she probably wouldn't wear that one too much. Um, but the other ones are pretty light and shimmery, and I thought that was a good set to start her out with because, you know, you don't want them to wear too much, but she does like to wear a little bit of eyeshadow, and she's wearing mascara now, so... I thought that was a good, nice, neutral, good start uh, set for her, and it's really affordable as well. I also picked her up this Rimmel Moisture Renew. It's a clear lip liner. She really doesn't wear lipstick, um, but she does like to wear lip gloss, and she's got a couple lipsticks that I gave her that were mine, um, but she's having a little bit of problem with, you know, typically lipsticks will kind of bleed outside of your lip line, and so I told her about clear lip liner. Um, that I use a lot and so she wanted one so I picked her up her own clear lip liner so it just really gives you that protection that barrier um, to keep your lipstick on your lips so they won't bleed out onto your face but it doesn't add any extra color and the last thing for her stocking is this kiss decals these are actually 
nail decals that I found at the Dollar Tree. Now the Dollar Tree brand nail decals do not work for us at all, but this is actually Kiss brand, which is more of a kind of something you'd find at Walmart. So I thought maybe it'd be worth giving these a try because like I said, she does like to experiment with her nails and colors and painting and things. So I thought that she might like these as well. So that is what we are putting in our 13 year old stocking this year. It's fun having girls because getting all this like girly beauty stuff is super fun for me. That's right down my alley. So getting those types of things for my daughters is really fun. I hope it gave you some ideas of what you might like to give a teenager or a tween in your life um, when they're starting out with makeup and, and tweezing and nails and all that stuff. Hopefully it gave you guys some ideas. I will try to have everything linked in the description box below for you guys in case you're interested in picking up any of these things for the kids in your life or the girls in your life. Um, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure if you didn't check out yesterday's video where we show you what we got her, where I show you what we got her for her tree gifts. Make sure you check out that video. It will be linked in the description box below. And make sure you stay tuned until tomorrow because I'm going to be sharing what we got our seven-year-old daughter for her Christmas tree gifts. And then the day after that, I'll be sharing what we got our seven-year-old for her stocking stuffer. So lots of gift ideas this week. So make sure you stay tuned to my channel. I'll have links for everything in the description box below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.